What's up? I'm Odin, and this is my big purple bus. Wahoo! Final checks, about to go up. <laughs> Final checks. Call, call for gas. It's another. You either want the wings on an airplane to be full of gas or the no gas. <laughs> so we try to put it away with a little gas in the pocket. Yeah, tires look good, little brakes, all that stuff. Just do that with this jumping wall real quick. Yeah, we about to be flying.
cold. It's clear, we can pour it back in so people just throw it on the ground. I have a good one then. Set off and I'll get you plugged in in the back. All right. Notice it's almost like you don't get in the plane, you strap it on. <laughs> right? Kind of like a fighter, right? <laughs> Formula One racer, you know, you kind of have to crawl in it, get strapped <laughs> in. Uh, this morning was pretty chilly. Went on the schedule for the afternoon. If I'd known I'd be, I'd be wearing jeans. <laughs> See, I wear shorts 24 7, even in the snow. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm warm-blooded for some reason, and people freak out when they hear that I'm from Louisiana. They're like... Oh, what part? Uh, Galliano. So I'm like two hours at? south of New Orleans. Okay. Now you're down there on the Delta. Yeah. I went to school in Lafayette. Lived there like 12 years. Oh, wow. My wife's in Baton Rouge. <laughs> nice. My uh, my mom and dad have family in Baton Rouge. In fact, we were married in uh, New Road, just outside Baton Rouge. I was born in Homa. Oh, Homa. <laughs> That's a big oil town. <laughs> Yeah, Fouchon is where I worked for the longest time. That's All a right. huge oil field. So if we have to get out for some reason, I'll flip this and this thing just goes forward. All you gotta do is like a car, you push this red thing in on the seat belt, mm -hmm. and you just go out that side. And we shouldn't be getting out if the prop is running. Uh, and so what we'll do, we'll just meet on the right side of the airplane over there on the right wing tip. Okay. Uh, if for some reason you're, if you start to feel nauseous, tell me. I'm gonna, not worried. Because we can adjust the profile. There's a vent right here. We do have to close the canopy once we start the engine, but we can open the windows here, and there's some other little tricks to stay cool. Once we get airborne, it'll be better, but it's almost like a greenhouse once we close this, but it, but it cools off pretty quickly. Uh, the seat back is fixed, so there's no adjusting that. Uh, there's no need for you to reach the pedals or anything like that. Um, if you see another airplane airborne, don't, don't assume that, oh, Bill's got it. Uh, just go, hey, another airplane. I'll go, shit, I didn't even know it was there. Okay. So just call out any kind of traffic that you may see. All right. And uh, during the flight, ask any questions, make any comments, film all you want. You can film all of this, film outside. I'll point out some cool things, you know, if you hadn't noticed already, and you can film as best you can. Sometimes through the glass, it's, it's a, you can cover, reduce the glare by taking, you know, your hand, you know what I'm talking about? Okay. Hide the glare, sometimes that helps. Well, I got this camera going 24. Like this one's like, it's a point of view camera, so it's, nice. it's recording right now. Nice, everywhere you look. And then I'll I'll pull my phone out and take pictures okay, or something cool. like that, maybe. And then, uh, like I said, we'll go around the back side of Pike Speak. It'll be a little bit bumpy like I talked about. And then uh, that's it. So cool. any any questions at all?
No, I'm, I'm excited. I'm ready. All right, cool. <laughs> Biggest challenge is, is figuring out which of these keys. There we go, that one worked. All right, so let's drop this down to the first notch. We're allowed to come right about there. There we go. We can open that up. No battery on, strobe on. Oh yeah, right inside. <laughs> Some of the things I gotta get to is over there, so if I va violate your man uh, space. You know, you know, violate me at all. We're in a tight situation and I understand. So the, that's all good. We'll go to the engine page. Take a, the tack is electronic, it sits right there. So I'll take a picture of that for the records. There we go. Put that away. Of course, a lot of things are in red, right? Because we don't have the engine start. And that all looks good. So we'll go key to both. About 1.2. Fuel pump on. Full rich. Two, three, four, five. We have fuel flow. Make sure it'll cut off. Come back to point four. And here we go for start. Clear prop. 